Gucci Mane's ice cream cone to 21 Savage's knife, rappers' face tattoos can be as iconic as their song. So we hit Rolling Loud in Queens, New York to see if hip hop fans can identify their favorite rappers by their face tats. Do you have any tattoos yourself? I do. One under my chest and then, yeah. <laughs> now, unfortunately, I still live with my parents. I got Harley Quinn because that's my girl, babe. Your movie coming out and it's going to be amazing. And I got new tatted right here on my neck. Let's get it. You know, Lobo. Well, I got my mom's name here. I got Nefertiti right here. Oh, your neck tat. Did it hurt? Lobo. Yeah, I have like my whole back right here, right here, my neck. Is it recent? Lobo. So no answers to that question. Thank you so much. So how do you think you're going to do? Um, I think I'm gonna do terrible, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna fuck this up. I'm gonna fuck it up, but fuck it. Nah, we're gonna kill it. We're gonna kill it for a fact. You got it? I know my shit. You're getting 100%. I love this confidence. Okay, let's see how we gonna do today then. Damn. Come on now. What's on his forehead? Is that 21 or no? <laughs> That's Lil Wayne. That is definitely Lil Wayne. Fear God, yeah. What was the giveaway? The, the cross thing in the middle of his head with the, yeah. Then he had that in the Part of Five album. What is that? Ooh. 21. Oh, yeah. 21, yeah, 21. 21. 21. It's a knife or it's a dagger? What does the cross on your forehead signify? It's a knife. Post Malone? Post Malone? How'd you know? His bushy ass eyebrows. <laughs> all right, that's Gucci. Burr. Just read the label on the ice one time. That's all I had to do. I feel like Gucci. He got some good tattoos there. Definitely <laughs> represent him with the ice cream and all, but just the yeah. wrong place. The real inspiration of behind the tattoo is just, I guess me thinking I'm the coldest I'm seeing in the game. Oh, <laughs> uh, come on. This is 6 9 <laughs> For me, the ride of the city, Drake. You ain't come home, you ain't coming here. Keep him. What do you think about 6 9 ines tattoos specifically? Personally, he has his own way of expressing himself. If he wants 6 9 ines all over him, that's him. No way I'm getting that. I, don't, I have no idea. I, I would say, I would say the game. When in doubt, let the ladies figure it out. It's a butterfly on it. Who is a butterfly oh, on Travis Scott. Page? It's Lil Easy Bird. Oh, wow. Yeah. I don't know who that is. Lil Sky? Uh, R.I.P. Lil P. I like the tax though. It's nice. He looks pretty. A teddy bear? Is it's that Lil Peep? Pink hair. Teddy bear. I don't know. Nicki Minaj? Cuban dog? Yeah, I'm gonna say Rico Nasty because it looks like a female. I'm gonna go with Cash Doll. Someone ah. wrong for I didn't even know she had tattoos. I'm not gonna hold you. She can pull off the tats on her face. You know what? She's the only person I know that can do that. That's Kalani. That's my type. That is Kalani. Definitely Kalani. Yeah, definitely Kalani. Definitely. Okay, how'd y'all know? Her eyes, the gauges. My woman crush. Girls with big foreheads is always cute and she's cute. You can't even see her forehead in this picture. I'm a huge Kaylani fan. The paper plane definitely knew it. That's a dead president on the face. I don't know who the hell put that on their face. Who is that? Paul Wall? What's this? Blue guy's face. Name? Correct. Trust Kelly. your gut. Blue face is correct. You was over here talking about machine gun Kelly. I should have guessed that. Yep. He would do some shit like that. Whoever that is look dirty. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's Lonnie Love. It's Devlin Love. Lil Pump. Lil Pump. It's the only one in the game with those eyebrows. Lil Pump, got all that money, get your eyebrows done, please. This nigga is a genius. No pun intended. Damn. Give me a hint. I'm gonna just take a guess. Is that like trippy red? Smoke perp. Ski mask or slump god. Like this new generation shit, like. <laughs> I can't. I think we did great. We the best group. Fuck Destiny Child. <laughs> and I'm off this. In New York City, 65 is passing. Exactly. That's graduating. I feel like tattoos boost your career. You can get a tattoo on your face and become a global sensation. I feel like if you want to get a face tattoo, that's your business. You know, as long as it looks good and it's nothing stupid, like fucking 6 9 Do you think that face tattoos are attractive? Depends who it is. If you ugly, you still ugly with face tattoos. You know what I'm saying? You know who got some hard ass face tattoos, but it's a little excessive? Um, blue face. I mean, a little cliche. But pretty dope, it's nice. As long as you plan to work for yourself for the rest of your life. Who's overdoing it? Is there one person where you're like, okay, it's enough is enough? Lil Zan, right off the top, he's overdoing it. With everything. <laughs> My only hope is that the uh, tattoo removal, I hope that it works good, because they're going to need it. Well, it looks like these tats have left a mark on more than just these rappers' faces. I'm Delisa with Genius News, bringing you the meaning and the knowledge behind the music.